Don't ask me any specific questions. You gotta explain. Yourself, no, I'm gonna dude. say some Come things, on. but you can't ask me specific questions. Okay. And there and there and there's good reason for it. All right, you can just tell your story. I don't have to say anything. No, it's not that. It's not that. I mean, I I love you to say something, but it's it's okay. that I'm not sure you're going to effectively p predict the boundaries of the story. Okay. And so, therefore, I am going to uh, maneuver my way around this story in a fashion that allows me to tell it. All right. Well, you put out the disclaimer. I'm just gonna. You know what? I, you know what I mean. Breath. You know what I. You you can understand what I what I would be insinuating there, right? Okay. Yeah. Do you? I mean. It's funny because you whatever got, you say, could no, be all. no, it's funny because you got this like TikTok banner and like we're about to chat about that. It is like, wow, man, a lot of stuff happened over here. Does it relate to TikTok? Not at all. OK, not at all. Not at all. Not at all. But if it's personal stuff, I mean, you'll have to. No, but it, no, you know what? You're right. I don't. But it's like at this point, I feel like there's a way I can do it. OK. I feel like there's a way I can do it. Yeah, no, and I just people been people have been they've been riding with us, man. Yeah, dude, and you're a storyteller. People have been riding with thing. us, so I just feel it's deserved at this point. People have been on this journey with us. Oh yeah. So saga continues. The car theft continues. Oh, that's still going on, eh? Well, it's brand new now. Okay. And I am so over this. You have no idea <laughs> how over this I am. Um, okay. I am... S the saga continues. Okay, you want to give everyone an update, though? Well, that's what we're... That's or, what... or not an update, like a summary. Well, a happened. summary... Oh. Okay, so for those of you that haven't followed along, car got stolen, huge freaking hassle. <laughs> Your face is so red. I recovered it. Okay, uh, I recovered it. Thought, okay, maybe this is going to be a straightforward thing. It wasn't straightforward at all. It took forever, and it was fingerprinting, and it's... 150 stolen cars a night and they're like give us a break give us some time and i'm at the pound trying to get it out and then the thing won't drive because of whatever the hell happened to the computer and whatever uh, uh components were snatched out of it mm -hmm. so it turned into a big goofy kind of insurance thing and put it all back together and premiums and this is like oh ho, 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 fun time Yeah. And then I'm like, okay, maybe I may maybe I got maybe I got some leeway here. Maybe I got some room for myself now. Maybe I got some you know. Like time to think, time to appreciate. I don't know. Like may, maybe it's just maybe just I can just uh maybe it can go back to but this stuff is rampant right now, dude. This stuff is so rampant right now. Like, I don't even know. I don't really have it. I don't think I have advice for it. Okay, let me just. I had an intuition yesterday. I had the strongest intuition for some reason that my car was going to get stolen again. That is so weird. Okay. I promise you, Will, I had a strong freaking intuition. Mm. I just felt it. I felt something was up. Was and it um, was it that day, or was it like a couple weeks ago, or what are you talking about? No, no. Like your intuition. Moments, moments before it happened. Oh. Moments before it happened, I like about an hour before it happened. I was like, someone's gonna tr take a crack at my car today. Mm -hmm. I felt it. 
Yeah. After that ordeal. I'm talking about think- I'm talking about yesterday, Will. Never mind months ago when this whole thing started. I'm talking about yesterday now. Yeah. So what happened yesterday? I'm talking about yesterday right now, dude. <laughs> what talking- time? I told you not to ask me specific questions. <laughs> No, not All the right. same. Not the same location. That's a specific question, but I can answer it vaguely. Not the same location. I probably did something stupid where I actually caught these dudes in the act. And I actually chased them off. Okay. And probably that would be ill advised. Uh huh. And I don't really know. I didn't really chase them off. It was just instinct to kind of like yell. Okay. They were, they were, you know, it's weird. It's a weird type of feeling you, you, you catch, you catch that in the act. And it's, you know, what else is weird is giving my previous story where that thing all culminated. Like this stuff is brazen now. It's so commonplace. It's so regular. You just feel it. Yeah. Dude, catching them in the act? That's serious. Oh man, now I want to dive into more more detail. <laughs> so what can you say? They got a technique to it where they try to minimize the appearance of what's going on and the you know they 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 try to get that that horn off on the alarm mm-hmm. i feel like i'm a i feel like i'm an expert in this now all the different techniques and tactics mm. they got to play around for a little bit to uh, cut the audio and it's easy for them to do from the outside of the vehicle. So the alarm actually goes off. But it doesn't make any noise. So you would have to see the flashing lights. The lights still flash and the alarm is still active. Okay. During these type of attacks. I had this strong intuition. That they were going to take a crack in my vehicle. Again. I don't know. I'm not suggesting it's the same they. I'm just saying that, like, this is so rampant right now. We're living in a different... I mean, people have always gotten into this business. But we're living in a time where this stuff is... We're living in an age. And... So I had this intuition... I decide to boot up that little app. I I don't know. I don't know what this intuition was, Will. I don't know what this intuition was. You were talking about Find My? No. Which one? I'm talking about the automaker themselves has an anti-theft thing. Okay. Like you can, there's an app for the car. Okay. And even in the absence of an alarm trigger that you could hear, the app is capable of reporting it, Mm. that the alarm has gone off. Mm -hmm. But of course, me, my phone is in do not disturb so much. It's just like, you know, but. So you got the notification, but it was just silenced. I got a notification Five minutes after the alarm had been triggered. And you want to know something crazy? I think some people might look at that and think, oh, some kind of malfunction, some kind of false alarm. But no, no, no. My intuition was so strong even before that that I go, no, it's on right now. It's on right now. (laughs) You chose violence. It's on. No, I'm just saying, like, it's the real deal. Yeah. It's happening right now. 
They got the little getaway car over there. Now, they had probably just short of enough time based on that gap that I was able to determine what was going on. And of course, if even if they got it, it would be traceable, but then it's the hassle associated with it. And it was just the frustration from the previous. But it's such a turnoff. I feel like I'm done with that vehicle. Really? Well, I mean, it's they, that hot. What? <laughs> Talking about, man. Kind of over this. Kind of over this at this point. It's all these type of anti thefts, right? Like, get a secondary horn, uh, put a club on it, put a, a flamethrower in the crotch. You know? Mm. I can't like holy moly now I will say I have some other systems on there now at this point that are being utilized and I don't think it would have been easy as it was last time I, I, I do think these guys got the wrong guy uh -huh. the second time around uh -huh. but it doesn't change the fact that this is now this is the type of thing I'm interacting with I'm trying to keep it clear up top mm-hmm trying to see clearly mm -hmm. got these guys turning things in turning turning my my head into scrambled eggs over here yeah. so all of a sudden then i'm like all right well <laughs> this thing is targeted right now i'm targeted right now And so I started doing my scans. Okay, whatever. Those guys, those guys have uh, taken off. The, I, the 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 vehicle is here. The vehicle is undamaged. Okay, 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 okay. Take a look around. Okay, okay. Then I go. They spot this baby. They just spot it over here, or. Uh, They've been following for a little bit, waiting for the right moment. Hmm. Hmm. Or they get a little tip. I start wondering. Start wondering, well, can't help it. I start wondering. A little skeptical. I start looking out the side of my eye over there. How do we get from A to B? How do we get from A to B? Hmm. Where's your boy over there that's supposed to send me a little keychain scanner so I can scan my stuff all the time? Yeah, we should get that. Where's that guy? We should get that. Because I'm scanning on these apps, and these apps are coming back with air tags, dude. Every time. And I can't pinpoint these damn things. I'm looking around. I'm upside down. I'm underneath. I'm looking like I'm changing the oil down there. We need this thing. Yeah, we need this thing. Hmm. I'll tell you what, Will. I'm at my wit's end. About, about to do something drastic out here. Don't do anything drastic, hey. man. Hey! Hey! Just, uh... Tell you what. You gotta let the cops handle it. Cops? As, as slow as it can be. Cops? You don't talking about get cops. Into some hairy situation. Talking about there, cops. Man. Cops. <laughs> you don't want to use a flamethrower on someone's crotch. Listen, man. Don't be a vigilante, okay? Listen, man. You had this encounter before, Will? You don't know how you're gonna act. This yeah. encounter, life is weird. You don't know how you're gonna act. You got people sifting through, sneaking about, tapping around. You don't know how you're gonna act. Mm -hmm. You get back to that vehicle, you see what's going on. You don't know how you're gonna act, Well, No.
So you, you let this baby keep going. You let this baby keep working the way it's working. Dude, I want to ask like the the specific questions, but I I don't know. You know, uh, I'll hit up my my pal over there, Hacksmith. He'll hit me with the bulletproof John Wick style. Yeah. You need a John Wick to help you out. Collaboration with Mark Rober. T- I, they got the wrong dude. Try, try to steal a car from Keanu Reeves. Hmm. Messed up. So you're Keanu Reeves now? <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh, man. So... Is there any information you can say as of right now? Like, what's the latest update? I'm done with this vehicle. I got this vehicle back. I I, I foiled that particular plan, personally, with some kind of weird... uh, Some kind of weird outer space intuition. I don't know what the hell I felt that made me do the checks and balances on it and actually catch it in the eye. It was crazy. Mm -hmm. Like, I just couldn't... I could have... I don't know. It could have went down differently. It didn't. But now I get this moment of say bye bye to this baby right here. That baby right there. Bye bye baby. Hello Cybertruck. I don't know. I don't know. Something something that's less in demand or tougher to steal. I'm about to partake on a heavily committed a bunch of like summertime endeavors and it's enough of a hassle where I'm like even if I win even if I got all your gadgets even if I got all your cameras and I got all your sentries and I got all your horns and I got all your flamethrowers it's it's the headache of it all it's the scrambled eggs of it all the war still goes on like by default I don't want to have such a market I don't want to have, like, we got a, some kind of supply-demand thing going on right now. And I'm squarely in the middle of it, apparently. Mm-hmm. On the supply side. Yeah. And I'm not trying to be a supplier in this department. No. I'm not trying to. I got other things you, going on. You just got a regular life. I need you that clarity. I need that clarity. Yeah. And so that's the stats where we're at right now. I don't know if we got to bring Mark Rober up here. I see all your comments. Uh, listen, you're going to catch these guys. We, we keep catching them. We put it out every day. We caught them. Guess what? 20 more. Obviously, if you could, if Mark Rober could change the punishment on it, thank that would be great. Mm-hmm. I don't think that's uh, his area of expertise. Maybe it is, Mark. Let me know. Yeah. You catch one guy, you got 12 more. Yeah, uh, I mean, Toronto is just really bad right now with car thefts. Terrible. How do you feel, though, mentally? Are you tired? Hmm. Gas, dude. Yeah? Oh. Good lord. Was it a long night? It always is. How are you supposed to relax, right? Yeah. We go do those type things. It's been how long? A month? A month and a half? Two months? I don't know. People over here saying like, okay, just, just, oh, well, insurance will sort it out new car move on yeah it's not that easy it's not it takes forever well it takes forever it's annoying and and it's really i think it's on principle like i don't actually think it's to do with the material possession i think mm-hmm. it's more the acceptance of a particular behavior and the lack of deterrence and then having to 
swim swim in that unwill unwillingly swim inside that chaos you know mm -hmm. that you didn't sign up for well or or that you would not recommend for others that you would not necessarily be a supporter of i mean i know there's always an element of it mm -hmm. but it's i mean to act like it has no disruption mentally to act like it has no consequence no residual i think is unrealistic mm. and i don't think it's i think if we get to a st uh, stage in society where that's just a kind of rollover if that's a rollover a, a lot of other things become a rollover roll over and die already well Someone's accusing you of being the insurgent, Will. Yeah. <laughs> Optimus Prime says, let's not accuse Will, guys. Grow up. He says, grow up. I got my Bronco. I am I think I'm good. <laughs> well, yeah, as far as you know, you got it. Yeah. <sighs> All right, well, I'll keep you posted on that. I'm trying. I'm gonna try to get rid of that vehicle at this moment. That's where my head's at with that. I will, will I'll give you more details after. That's the, all the details I can share at the moment. All right, on that topic. Well, I gotta say that I'm glad that you're safe. I'm sure the community thinks that as well, and uh, hopefully you bounce back soon. No, I'm good. Like I listen. Because the first time, like, was a major headache. And I don't think the second time is easier. Well, it is, functionally speaking. Like, I don't have to go through all the processes because of... But just the mental Yeah, there, the, there's mental... There's residual there. With Within a short amount of time, too. That's intense. But as a result, you're going to have to carry the show today. I don't think so. I've been waiting. I'm tired. We've been waiting. As a result, you're going to have to carry the show today. I'm good. So. Mo, where are you? <laughs> you want to talk about TikTok? Yeah, just one TikTok. TikTok. 